Army leadership gathered on Fort Benning for a side-by-side -side live fire demonstration that examined the operational benefit of a medium caliber weapon system on a striker infantry carrier vehicle. During this demonstration, spectators were able to see the capabilities of the current striker vehicle with a 50 caliber machine gun next to a more lethal 30 millimeter weapon system. The 30 millimeter was chosen because it's a weapon system that's currently in the DOD inventory. Ammunition has already been type classified for this weapon system, so it maintains commonality across multiple branches of the military. Compared to the 50 cal, the 30 millimeter was able to show an increased precision fire. As they hit targets ranging from 800 to over 1500 meters. Currently, the 50 caliber machine gun is accurate to out, out to about 1500 meters. Uh, there's also a suppressive weapon system. The 30 millimeter provides you accurate precision fires out past, well past that, to approximately 3,000 meters. By leadership viewing this proof of principle demonstration in person, it emphasized the dramatic difference between these weapons and the lethality they offer soldiers downrange. It's just like one after another. Just, I mean, it's dead on once it's zeroed um, versus the 50 cal, which is more of a area target. So, I mean, the first couple rounds, you have a couple rounds hitting the target and then sporadically after it. This demonstration by the Capabilities Development and Integration Directorate, along with the Maneuver Battle Lab, shows this weapon-vehicle combination is possible and gives Army leaders the most accurate and up-to-date information for future decisions. I heard expression, don't be a, a knife to a gunfight. That's kind of what this is. You're being a third might might to the fight and, you know, it's over. They see that thing going off and you're going to destroy anything you shoot at. Melissa Bell, Fort Benning TV.